Hey everyone, I haven't vlogged in so long and I just got the urge to vlog. Um, so I just pulled out my camera and I had to search for my memory card for a second, but I found it. Don't look at my face because I'm like barely looking make uh, wearing makeup. And don't look at my hair because this happened in like five seconds in the car this morning driving to work because that's how lazy I am. Um, well, just today because I woke up a little late. But um, I just came upstairs to get changed and I ate and... I'm going out to run some errands because, oh, I came in here to get this bag. Oh, that was this making noise. So I'm making a cake pop arrangement for this weekend. And so these are the containers that I'm using and I got these marbles to go in it, but I need more. So I'm bringing this with me to see if I can get the same one. And I'm also going on a crazy hunt to try to find these cake pop sticks that I once use the like blue with some polka dots on them. I'll show you my whole idea, but uh, Michael's coming to pick me up and we're going out to um, a f bunch of stores just to get all the rest, the rest of the stuff that I need for my cake pops. And yeah, I got everything in here. Okay, let's go downstairs and wait. Anyways, oh, and shout out to the subscriber that I met today. I met, uh, met yeah. I don't know her name. She didn't tell me, but. If you're watching, I shout out to you. You know who you are. She was in college in her third year, so she's the same age as me, probably. But anyways, um, I wanted to get a picture and show you guys the cake pop sticks that I'm referring to because I was talking about them. So this is the picture of the cake pops that I made a few months ago for my cousin's uh, communion, and so now I'm making very something very similar Sorry for all the speed bumps, it's like shaking. Uh, something very similar for Mike's cousin's baby shower. So I don't know if you can tell, but they're, the sticks are blue and they have white polka dots on them. And I've been calling um, like so many party cities because that's where they're from. I called two locations and I went to the one closer to me, but then my mom works uh, at like in a different city and so there was two closer to her. So I called both of them and they both did not have them. So, and they don't have them online either, so I can't order them online. So I'm thinking that they just don't, aren't selling them right now. Um, so I'm going to Bulk Barn to see if they have something similar like that, because they have in the past. Um, Michael's might even be a, uh, an option. I have my own store. The craft store. Um, or else I'm just gonna have, going to have to get white ones from the dollar store but I also need to go to the dollar store and get the foam that I put inside of the vases to make them stay as well as I need more of these marbles so we have a few errands to run <laughs> wherever you need to go we'll go just because I want to make sure that I have everything so that when I start making them I don't like you know forget anything oh but I'm gonna show you my design so I'm making them into like teddy bears so I'm doing some blue like this. Hopefully this will focus. Yeah, so some blue like this, maybe not with the drizzle on top. And then, let me find the picture that I found on Pinterest. Then I'm gonna make, try to make some into teddy bears like this. So we're gonna see how this works out. And I'll let you know. Maybe I'll post a picture on Instagram or something so you guys can see them because I don't know. I'm this it's a, it's Tuesday today. I'm not and I'm not making them till uh, Friday or Saturday, so probably won't be able to vlog what the what the finished product looks like. But we'll see. So it's now dark outside, which just goes to show how much time I always spend in the dollar store. But well, I went to Bulk Barn first, and I got all the chocolate that I needed. So I'll show you guys that when I get home because it's lighter. Um, and then I got a bunch of stuff at the dollar store, but I did not find the cake pop sticks and it's like 10 minutes to 9 o'clock, so everything's gonna be closed. So I think I'm just gonna have to get white ones and do something to make them more like decorative, I guess, but maybe simple is better, so we'll see. And, oh, the best part about our trip to the dollar store is I got... Bueno. Bueno. And I got two of them. And actually, I've seen these in one of the, I think it was like dry, um, one of those videos like trying British candy and I think they have these, this in this, in the video. Kinder? 
Is this like a English thing? These are like my favorite chocolate ever. They're so good. If you ever have the opportunity to try them, do it. And if you didn't like it, it probably wasn't a fresh one because these are amazing. They have like a hazelnut filling on the inside. I'm just gonna open it and show Each you guys. Each bite is filled with goodness. Heavenly, heavenly. And they're shareable because they're, they come with two bars like a Twix, but they're individually wrapped. So you can have one now and one later. Cheers. So I'm finally home and I laid everything out so that I can show you guys a quick little haul. So the first thing that is unrelated, I found these black bins at the dollar store and I have like the smaller version and I'm using them for an organization video that you guys can look out for soon. So they had these ones. Honestly, I feel like every time I go to the dollar store, they have something new. So, or they never have the same thing that they had before. So I found these, they were two for a dollar, I think. Oh, two for a dollar 25. Then I got uh, these foam blocks. I wish they were white, but the only like large ones that they had are the the ones for plant floral stuff. So I used these to stick um, the cake pops in and I got this blue tissue paper to cover them in so you don't see the green. And it matches the chocolate perfectly. So I got the chocolate up bulk bar and I got blue, got some white, I got some dark chocolate just for like decorating accents. Uh, and then I got regular brown chocolate and I'm gonna use this for the teddy bears and then these for the accent, but I'm probably gonna mix some of the white into that. This makes it a little bit lighter so that there's more contrast. But you can tell it's definitely darker. And then I found these little, they're not really like chocolate chips, but they're like round little nubs. So I'm gonna use these for um, the ears of the, of the bear. I showed you guys a picture of what I'm making. And that's all that I got at Bulk Barn. Then this is the other Bueno chocolate bar that we didn't eat yet. And then I got these um, these containers, acrylic containers at Party City a while ago. I showed you guys, or like last week, a while ago. I showed you guys these earlier. And I, I bought these marbles um, maybe two weeks ago at another dollar store, but I like the ones that I just bought now better. You can't really tell too much on the camera, but these ones that I bought tonight are like more clear. These ones have more of like, like a green tinge and they're more like metallic. So I like these ones better, but I'm just gonna mix them because I had to get more marbles for the bottom of the vase. And then I'm gonna put the foam covered in tissue paper here and then I stick them all in. And then I got uh, the clear cellophane to wrap up the arrangements and the rest of the other things I already have to make the cake pops. And that's it. That's what I got on my trip tonight. Mom, you wanna say hi to the vlog? <laughs> she's watching Little People Big World, but I muted the TV for this vlog clip. So <laughs> she's watching it with no sound. You could turn it back on, thanks. <laughs> These are my finished cake pops. I just wanted to share how cute they came out. I made four of these arrangements and then this is them at the baby shower on the sweet table. Hey, so it's the next day and I just got ready. Oh my God, this lighting is making me look tan. I just got ready. I've been liking the half up, half down ponytail right now because it really just gets your hair out of your face but it still looks cute because like your hair is down. Um, so I did that and then I'm wearing this Little tank top says little party tank. I don't know, it's just cute. I had like a black crop top that I was gonna wear with this outfit, but I figured like it's better that I don't show so much stomach. And then um, I'm wearing this maxi skirt and it's just gray and it has black stripes on it so it matches the black. Um, and then it has a slit so it's perfect because it's hot outside but I didn't really shave my legs so it's good. Um, I did my nails this morning actually. They're just blue. Um, let me see, actually, I have the nail polish here in my office where I painted. So it's China Glaze and it is called Flying High. So that's the nail polish that I did this morning and I also like crossed a bunch of things off my to-do list this morning. I sent off a few emails that I had to do um, and just kind of got myself organized, which was awesome and it's 
11 o'clock so I've done a lot this morning already and now I'm just waiting for my friend Nikki you guys haven't seen her in, in a vlog in a while um so she's coming over um and then we're gonna go to the mall so we're just kind of meeting here and then we're gonna do lunch and go to the mall and I don't know I've just been wanting to get a few things for back to school I guess like clothes wise so I'm just looking for a few staples and that's about it oh my that's my phone she's probably here so we met up with Alyssa now. We're done at the mall though. And I just got this smoothie here. We're getting food. It's a peach smoothie, it's so good. And then I got a slice of pizza. Mmm, it smells so good. I'm really excited. How's that one? Really good. What's on it? Um, I don't remember. It was Mediterranean. There's um, olives, goat cheese, and some other stuff. It's really mm. good. Hey, so I'm back at home now. Um, Nikki and I went to the mall for like four hours or so. <laughs> And we had a good day together and um, then we met up with Alyssa because she was at work. So we got pizza with her while uh, she was on break. But I thought I'd bring everything inside and we'd do a little haul. Uh, it wasn't enough to do like its own haul, I guess. So I guess we just show, we'll just show you what we got. So this is my big purchase of the day. I uh, got a bag at Kate Spade. Let me take it out. Oh, Merloe, you're so, so cute. cute. He's Hi, like, puppy. He's sitting on his bum right now. <laughs> Cutie patootie. Okay, so I got a bag at Kate Spade. At the end of every summer, after working hard, I usually treat myself to a little something something. So I got this bag here. And I'm surprised that I didn't get it in black because I'm always like a black purse kind of girl. But yeah, my favorite feature of it um, is the strap, so it's all wrapped up, but it's a long strap so I can wear it like cross body. So I really like it and I'm so happy. And it's just a lot bigger and more functional, but it still is cross body, so I can use it every day. So this is going to be like my new everyday purse. And I'm just really happy that I got that. And even the little dust bag has a quote on it, the Kate Spade quote, so it says she tucked her coral lipstick away and floated back to the party. <laughs> so I thought that was cool. And then I just got a few uh, clothing pieces from H&M. Because H&M is like my favorite store recently. Oh, first things first, I got socks and like this was one of my favorite purchases besides, you know, my bag. But I've been needing new socks and I like the ones from there because they, I don't know, they just feel good and whatever, they're just black. And then I got this uh, little like cardigan thing. Put it on for you. So just kind of like looks like that. It's nice and droopy and flowy. And then I got these pattern pants and I swear I already have these pants in two other colors but <laughs> I don't have a pattern one and they just fit me nicely so I got these. They're like dressy but almost like still like a dressy casual. And then Nikki picked this out for me. It's just a, a turtleneck top and it's just white and it was $10 so it's nice just a staple piece to have and that's all I got. So we'll see what Nikki got. <laughs> Uh, which one should I do first? Whichever. Okay, I went to H&M as well. And... Okay, I got the same pants as Rachel, but in black. Oh yeah, I didn't even know yeah. they were the same ones. They have gold zipper, so that's cute. Um, this is like How much favorite. even were these pants? I don't they even... were $20. Oh, 19... that's good. 19 yeah. Yeah, they were really good. I like this pattern. And then I got this... This vest. Which was a little more pricier, but I think it's so cute for the fall. Yeah, I know. I bought, they had all the fall stuff I coming. seriously bought all black today. Like, <laughs> that's actually ridiculous. Okay. And then I bought uh, this shirt. Hello. Do you like it too? Do you like it? <laughs> so I bought that shirt to wear with like a high-waisted skirt. Like a long pencil skirt. And then I went to Aritzia. Where I did some damage. Oh, there's a horse on the bag. No, that's a dog. Oh, we know that's a horse. I don't know. I was laughing because I did a DIY with the Ritzia bag and I'm like, you crumpled it. You can't use it for decor now. <laughs> oh, it's a dog. Look. Oh, Merlo, that one's so cute. Look, you should be featured. Yeah, you should be, be Merlo. You should be. Mm -hmm. You're so cute. <laughs> okay, so this is... I've been wanting these two pieces for like a really long time. So, I guess there's really no front. This is um, like a turtleneck. It's just like a black blob on the screen. Yeah. Oh. 
It's like a turtleneck. Uh, and then it has um, not quite a dress, like a tunic. Yeah, it's like a it's a sweater. And it has like these slits. It's really nice. It comes in a bunch of different colors. I bought that. And then I bought this scarf. In August. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. it's nice though. Oh wow, the, you could like use that as a tapestry on your wall. No, I want to wear it. And I know, but that would be really it, nice. It's like this. I love the it's colors. Too, yeah, I love it too. Um, who even knows? You, know. you just wrap it around. <laughs> <laughs> if I could find the whole, yes. Yeah, I really like your dress today. Where is it from? Uh, Forever 21. Really? It's nice. Yeah. It looks like expensive. No, I bought it last year from Forever 21. Yeah, it's really nice. I like it. Thank you. And, and that's, that's it. it. All right, so that's it for the haul. Nikki just left, but look at this little teddy bear. You're so cute. I love you so much, Merlo. It's so hot out today. I'm honestly thinking about going swimming. Look at the pool. So nice. I should go outside and feel it. Merlo, you wanna go? Let's see. Come, come on. I'm not wearing shoes. I just wanna feel how warm it is because it's been really hot the last few days. Oh, it's not like yeah, it's nice. I'm just a baby. I really like when the pool's like 90 degrees, but it's nice and warm. You're so cute, puppy. What did you do today? I should attach a vlog camera to your head. <laughs> no photos, please. But yeah, I'm really happy about my purse, purse purchase today. I've been really wanting a bag for um, a long time now. Like I've just been thinking about it and so we, like impulsively walked into Kate Spade. We were actually going to get lunch and then we walked by it and I was like, oh, I just wanna go in for a second. 10 minutes later, I bought a bag. Like within 10 minutes, I was sold and I just had to get it. And, I, and it's usually not like me to make impulsive purchases like that, but I've just been wanting a new bag. Um, and I really, really like it. I like the color, it was just perfect. So I got it <laughs> and I'm still really happy about it. So that's how you know it's a good purchase. But yeah, I had a fun day. I got to see all my friends. Um, and I don't know what I have planned for the rest of the night. I might go swimming or I might film a video or I might just like do nothing because I'm tired and I just, I just need those nights where I just do nothing because I feel like I'm always up to something. So it's nice to take a night off for a little bit. Thanks for coming along with me. I had a, fun, a lot of fun vlogging uh, for the last two days. And that's about it. Hopefully I'll vlog again soon. And I will talk to you guys in my next one. Bye.